When famine struck Bethlehem in Judea, a family left the land they owned there and traveled south in search of a new life. The journey itself was not without risks for Elimelech, his wife Naomi, and their two sons. Famine had forced them away, but Judea was all they had known. Anywhere else would be foreign. Moab was a country often at war with their own. But when Elimelech saw the fertile plains, he decided they would settle there. Elimelech, Naomi and their sons were content with their new life. They worked hard and they prospered. But then a sudden illness struck down Elimelech and he died. Her sons had chosen two Moabite girls, Orpah and Ruth. For Naomi, the marriages meant the chance of children and the continuation of her husband's family name. But within months of their marriages, both sons died, and with them, Naomi's hopes for a family vanished. I must return to Bethlehem. Why? But why, Naomi? God's hand is against me. Our family name ended here in Moab. We're coming with you. Yes. It's far too dangerous for a woman alone. But what more can I suffer? I've lost everything. You still have us? You must stay here with your people. You're still young. You can marry again. I have no more sons to offer you. We'll never forget you. May God reward you. Your love for my sons was great. And even now you honor them with your love for me. <gasps> Follow your sister, Ruth. Go back to your mother. No. You are my mother now. Where you go, I will go. And where you live, I will live. Your people will be my people. And your God, my God. Where you die, I will die. And there will I be buried. <laughs> 